everyone, it's Jenny. And today I'm going to be sharing with you my all time favorite primer. And some of you may know what it is. And I know I'm still on primer week, even though last week I didn't get any videos uploaded. But I did have to share this with you all. The Smashbox Photo Finish Foundation Primer. Now this is the one I'm using. This is the old packaging. A lot of you would recognize they had this packaging forever. And then I do have my backup ready to go. This is uh, the original Photo Finish Smooth and Blur Primer. So they made it a little bit, you know, fancier. But I like both packaging. They're both nice. I, I like them. So the Smashbox Photo Finish Foundation Primer. That is a mouthful. The full size which is this is the full time full size which is i believe uh one fluid ounce 30 milliliters is 36 dollars i know that is pricey especially for a primer but it's so worth it out of any primer i don't know i just love this primer it was one of the first actual primers i used and um it just agreed with my skin and i couldn't believe after i used it how well it made my makeup stay it looked beautiful so um it's 36 dollars. you can get it um of course at smashbox.com you can get it at the alta or the sephora all the prices are going to be the same and um, they do have the smaller sizes which i think i want to say those are either 12 or 15 i can't remember i just usually always buy the full size they do have different variants of primers i know they have like one for redness um, I know they have like a purple one um, and they have the radiance primer which I thought I was gonna I thought it was gonna take over this primer and I do love radiant primers but it's just not the same as these guys um, so it's a clear primer gel I will I will demonstrate here most of you all know this has been a, an OG you know original primer for a long time for a lot of people and it's just a clear primer. That's what she looks like. And then you just smooth it out onto your skin and it just makes your skin feel super smooth, almost like a, a canvas almost. And um, so the, it smooths, it blurs, it's uh, free of parabens, phthalates, it's vegan and also cruelty free. So that is two thumbs up for me right there. It's supposed to reduce fine line and pores. I got my notes here. Um, locks in makeup. I totally agree that it locks in makeup. Totally agree with that. It's lightweight and oil free. I do agree with that. It's very lightweight. It, it's, it just blends and melds into the skin beautifully. Um, it says glides onto skin. Totally agree with that. It's got antioxidants and vitamin A and E to help protect, help protect skin from environmental pollutants, damage, and stress. Now that I don't I don't know how much I can attest to that, but it definitely glides on skin. It's smooth. I definitely think it blurs. Now with pores, I don't I'm not I don't have a whole lot of pores that show through except for on my nose. I'm lucky in that sense. But I do think it it gives a nice smooth finish to the skin. Um so let's get into the reviews. I did the Sephora and Ulta reviews. I didn't go on Smashbox.com, but I figured Sephora and Ulta was good enough for me. Um, Sephora, it's got 7,095 reviews with a 4.3 star rating. It has got 4,573 five stars. That's pretty amazing. And it's got 351 one stars. Now at Ulta, there was only 2,177 reviews, and it's got a four and a half star rating. A little bit higher than Sephora, but not as many reviews as Sephora. So it has got 1,592 five stars, and only 101 one stars. So I think across the board, most people enjoy this primer. For me, I love it. It's my holy grail. I will continue to purchase it. If I never try another primer or uh, this will always be my go-to primer it just works well with my skin has anybody else do you use this primer have you tried it do you love it do you hate it let me know in the comments below I'm super interested to know it's one of my holy grail makeup products I always have it in my makeup stash somewhere so give me tell me what you think about it 
sound off in the comments down below. Remember, also, subscribe to my channel. Give a big thumbs up. I still have my beauty giveaway going. You have to be subscribed to enter. And with that, I hope you have a fabulous day. Bye.